floating offshore wind farms are becoming a crucial source of renewable energy in the fight to combat the global climate crisis. Riser cables connect floating wind turbines to the seabed export cables. They experience a lot of failures, making them one of the most unreliable components of the wind farm. We are proud to present an autonomous cable inspection robot, which can attach to and traverse the cable, identifying damage and collecting valuable data on the cable's behaviour. It feeds this information back to cable manufacturers and operators, allowing them to improve designs and implement effective maintenance strategies. The design is compact and lightweight, allowing it to inspect 38 meters per hour in strong North Sea currents. Ultrasonic sensors automatically detect when the cable is in position ready to be gripped. The self-centering jaws keep cables with a range of diameters concentric to ensure successful inspection. Compliant jaws make the system robust to marine growth on the cable and combined with intelligent force monitoring ensure the cable is not damaged during an inspection. A six-stage clamp and push drive method ensures a consistent, secure connection to the cable. Spring-loaded rollers allow the moving jaw to roll efficiently without losing cable contact. The average speed of the system is 38 meters per hour, comfortably inspecting a full riser cable within an eight-hour shift. Igus plastic bearings ensure efficient motion with no lubrication. A 200 Newton drive actuator means the system can climb a vertical cable with ease. A visual processing algorithm autonomously detects cracks and other damage on all 360 degrees of the outer sheath. Combined with position data, this allows cable operators to plan targeted preventative maintenance tasks. No human interaction is required during an inspection. The system is aware of its environment, able to react to unexpected obstacles and automatically identify when the inspection is complete. Eventually, this system has the potential to help the UK reach its goal of net zero by 2050 by increasing the reliability of offshore floating wind farms.